Hey, 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 welcome back. Um, as always, we're trying to do new things on the program. Um, today I see there's yet another Hyperbullet tournament, and so I'm going to try something a bit different today. Um, so, you know how normally when you're playing a chess game, um, this is what it looks like. And let's see, where's my setting for this? Well, I guess I'll just go into my user preferences and set it this way. Um, let's see. Actually, well, no, we're not going to turn that on. That would be cheating. Yeah, we're going to turn on blindfold mode. Hopefully, all will work out just fine here. Um, hopefully, I will play good moves, and we will all be entertained. Or at least the entertainment value is going to be there. So, just make sure uh, all's up and running. And yeah, let's do this. Let's play the Bit Chess Hyper Bullet. Uh, which concludes about one hour from now. Uh, ready. Hope you're ready, because I'm not. Here we go. Ready. See um, let's see, which color am I playing? Oh, I'm playing black. Check. I might not be doing so well this event. Uh, was that mate? Yes. Damn it! Okay. Uh, just to clarify, that was the bishop on d3. This knight's still on f3. Okay. Yeah. I, I'm always looking for something new and interesting, and this hyper bullet thing gets boring really quickly. So, I'm doing something to make it more interesting. Ready. Yeah, no, we're doing it. Uh, we're gonna give it a try. The hope is that I win a game. I hope I'm not setting the bar too high here. Um, maybe I am. Uh, crap, I have to take that. You take my queen. Okay, I take your queen. Check. Uh, I protect my pawn. No, this is going to be, like, retardedly, stupidly hard. Um, but the wonderful thing about it is that... Um, uh, that I might actually win a game, and even if I don't, I might still win a prize. Just given the prize structure. Uh, it's not like I'm trying to lose. Check. Uh, wait, how'd that knight get... Oh, crap, I'm in check. Uh, wait, where's my pieces? Okay, I have a knight. You lose. All right. Um. Yeah. This is a bit Ready. challenging. Um. Oh, I'm playing black. Okay, I'll take that. Wait. Bishop e2. Okay. G5. Check. No, it's not mate! No! How's this not mate? Okay, he's got his bishop on G5. I need to not lose my queen. Check. Alright, how's that not mate? Check. Okay, his bishop. Check. Okay. This king goes out to c3. Uh, that's not good. Alright, I won a game. Ready. Win it on time. 
Oh, that's actually what I should be doing this whole damn time, actually. Um, just play some really solid moves and don't hang anything and try to win on time. Oh, okay. Defend my pawn. Can I take that? Okay. Wait, should be two. Victory. All right, two wins in a row. Ready. We're on a hot streak, guys. Um, I go first? No, I don't. Well, I've played b6 now. There's no taking it back. Um, I should note that white always moves first in chess, and I should have a better idea just by looking at the game information if, if I'm playing white. Um, I should just look at that to figure this out instead of guessing. Oh, wait. He's forked me. Oh, he takes my knight. And he didn't see it. Um... I'm not winning this on time. Uh, crap. Where are my pieces? Okay. You lose. Uh, that's too bad. Yeah, that's actually the other thought here is that I'm not going to win first place. So we're going to try to Ready. earn so accidentally just earn some multiple of 100. But in the meantime, uh, see if I can do something kind of funny. Crap, is that not defended? It's, wait, did I, I missed a queen hanging? No. Okay. Castle? Oh, he's not gonna castle. Oh, is this hanging? I'm gonna go back. Wait. Oh, his bishop moved. Um. Takes? No. Something. Hey, there's a move. All right, and that's right, I put my bishop on e8. Um, I wish I could visualize this better for you guys somehow. If Sadly, there's no way for... Wait, I go first. Oh, crap. Yeah, there's no way for me to easily capture my board without seeing it. Um, Alright, so we're gonna... wait. Now I take this, he takes my knight, I put this here. Uh, okay, he's defending, so I'll go after the pawn this way. Having one target actually makes this a little bit easier. Wait, there's something there. Okay, take my pawns. Okay, I've already moved my knight apparently. Uh, we're gonna take. No, I can't take there. Uh, can I hit the queen? No. Check. Defend the rook. Uh, crap. Check. Victory. Nice. I'll take it. I'll take it. But yeah, if you follow along on Lee Chess while I'm doing this live, you might get a better visualization than I can Ready. offer. Uh, I'm playing black. Alright. 
Uh, we'll play the French. Uh, okay, we got an advanced French, but he doesn't suspect F6. Uh, wait. Okay. Uh, I guess I'll take here. Okay, I guess that was defended, and his bishop's not hanging. Uh, wait, why is that legal? Like, I knew I was screwed if that weren't legal, but I don't know why it is. Check. Okay, yeah, is this hanging? No. Uh, there's pawns in the way or something. Check. No, go, go, go. Victory. Yes. In some ways, Hyperbullet's the only kind of chess you can win doing blindfolded if you're bad at chess. Um, Ready. Okay. Uh, I'm playing white. We're going to play e4. Okay, we're just going to King's Gambit this up. Oh, crap. That's no good. Can't castle just yet, but at least we'll stop Check. the fork. Uh, okay, I can't do bishop e3. Oh, well, that's not safe. Check. I can't castle. I've... Yeah, we're just gonna run. Defend this. Check. Uh, hit the queen, take the queen. Wait, do I have not have a knight? Okay, I do have a knight. Check. Check. Go, go, go. Run with the king. Wait, is that a queen? Victory. Nice. Alright. These keep getting more and more difficult, I must say. Take that. All right. Check. No, that's not check. He hasn't recaptured yet. That's the deal. I can take there. Bishop takes. Uh, trade. Okay. Bishop takes here. Defend my bishop. Castle. Check. Okay. Now he takes. I do rook takes, and now I castle. And then rook takes rook. Just gonna move quickly. Wait. None of the moves I want to play are legal. Huh, I'm just going back and forth taking his pieces. It's actually mildly amusing. You lose. Alright. Couldn't keep up with the bullet mouse. It's hard to do that when you can't see the pieces. Going <sighs> okay. Here we go against Nick. Uh, wait, I can't take anything there. I'll just castle here. Check. There goes my queen. Just go, go, go. Take one of those. Go over here. Oh, can't take that. Oh, Check. it's not a capture either. Cannot move my king. Where's my king? Check. Uh, where is my king? I can't see my king. Apparently I'm in check or something. Oh, that was a good game. <laughs> Knight g3, check. Oh, okay. Yeah, good game. <laughs> well played. You got me, man. Uh, I might not be winning rating points. Oh, hey, look, we got our good friend Nick here again. 
Uh, wait. I smell a trap. I'll go here. Okay. Okay, I guess that was defended or something. Check. Why do I have so many pieces Check. in the way? Check. 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 You lose. Bummer. All right. Three losses in a row. It was bound to happen eventually. Okay. Wait, free night. Free bishop? Free queen. We'll take it. I'll need every half point I can get. Ready. It's difficult. Uh, that's not legal. That's legal. I found a legal move, guys. Uh, do I have a knight back here? Alright. I actually have a queen back there too. Um take that. Get out of dodge. Check. Can I not take that? There's something in the way. Use. Something prevented Rook takes E2. Bummer. Ready. Okay. I go first. Oh, crap. Uh, let's try to get out of here. Have I already moved my pieces? I can't tell. Getting mated. Um, yeah. yeah, I didn't even see a way to move my pieces there. I think he had a pawn on b4. I'm not sure why I couldn't. I guess I could have moved my c pawn, unless it was blocked somehow. Um, oh, hang on. Knight fd2, we take there. Wait. I need to push my E pawn. I don't have anything there anymore. Oh crap. Something tells me I might not be winning that. Um 
Hmm. There's tons of games this... Okay, so we're, we're going to give up on the Fianchetto idea. It's not working. Oh, crap. Oh, I'm at least limiting my losses to a pawn. I thought I was going to lose a knight. Check. Oh, my queen's on c7, not... Okay. Oh, uh, you know, it takes my rook. Check. You lose. It appears I'm not keeping up with my opponents here. Yeah. Well, once you get paired against people who have scored points, um, that's when it gets difficult. Because they're the ones who can move the mouse fast enough to actually uh, beat you on time. Uh, e3, d3, f3, e4, e5, I'm going to take that. Victory. So, yeah, the, the unfortunate part is that Lee Chess doesn't have a way for me to capture the board so you guys can Ready. see it. But you guys can verify with me that I am playing this blindfolded. And I am playing quickly and playing legally and not using any kind of assistance. Uh, uh, I'm not sure how else to do this. Uh, I have to take the knight. Oh, let's go back. Hit the queen. It's not a queen. Oh wait, no, the queen just detoured back to a7. Where's my queen? Wait, it's my move. I can't take anything. Check. You lose. Huh. That's a shame. Oh, you can watch at Leeches. If you want to watch me on Leeches, you can see me hang the pieces. Uh, just go to the website and watch my games there. Ready. Uh, Sadly, it won't be so easy to match up the games after this, like for people who are not watching it live. They don't get the full benefit of watching me hang things, because you won't actually get to see me hang them. Um, uh, okay, we're going to step out of this, defend that. Wait, what is this piece? It's a bishop. Where are my pawns? Here's a rook. There goes my rook. I might not be winning this. Oh, he took my rook. That's what's lit up there. An arrow indicating the last played move would help, in addition to just the highlighted squares. Yeah, I missed the ladder. Uh, for those watching live, go ahead and go over to Lee Chess and you can watch, like, um, 
I'm sure somebody can give you the link, but there's a way you can follow my games live. Uh, okay. Knight takes f7, really? Am I hanging something? Oh, crap! Check. Uh, go back. Knight c6, rook e8. Check. Okay. I don't know what my opponent's doing. Check. Nice! I just checkmated my opponent. Um. Yeah, you can go over to Leech Us and just click on my name and follow my games there. Uh, I'm playing white. I guess. Check. So the key for me is to play ultra super predictable moves and try to remember what it is that I played. Wait. Okay. He moved really quickly there. It's like he made two moves at once, but he didn't. Um, Check. Wait, can I not take that? Take this. Oh, crap. It was defended. Um, Check. Uh, okay. I can't take that either. Um, where do I go? Oh. My king was on e1, not on c1. How did my king end up on e1? That's kind of weird. No, I am the only person playing this blindfolded. Ready. I can virtually guarantee you that. Nobody else is crazy enough to do this feat. Not even no joke would attempt this. Uh, okay, I'm gonna check. We're gonna block the check. And he's gonna trade, and we take. Uh, castle. Okay, we attack the pinned piece. We double up on this pinned piece because I'm not sure what's really attacking it. Okay. Oh, wait, I could have taken e5. Uh, I'm taking it anyway. Let's take the queen. Okay, defend my rook. Can I take that. Hit his rook. Victory. Nice. <sighs> yeah, Amber's not around anymore. There's just this. Ready. Uh, I'm playing black. I am not ready. Okay, he's hitting my center. I'm going to go back. Uh, go forward, hit this knight. He's going to take here. Check. Take back. Uh, I can't castle. So oh crap! I hung my rope. Check. Um, check. Wait, that's check? check. Okay, that's check. Now we need to get my bishop out. And get checked. To oh, he's not going to check me this time. Wait, this isn't. Check. Okay, bishop takes. Check. Bishop takes check. I don't know what I'm doing now. That's legal, that's legal. We're just gonna move the king a bit. You lose. Bummer. Yeah, it's one of the sound effects is um, the robot voice, they call it. I don't know, it sounds actually pretty human to me. Oh, there goes my queen. Uh, 
going to stop his pawn, protect my own pawn. Wait, march my king forward a little bit. Wait, I had something hanging there. Let's hit that. Okay, let's hit that. I'm not of a knight here. Victory. Yeah. So the trick is to play quick enough to win the games. Well, I'm just saying that the voice isn't that terrible. I mean, obviously it's synthesized, obviously it's not a human, but it doesn't sound entirely robot-like either. Usually when I think of a robot, I think of like a engine, like a noise that's just a gradual grinding noise. Um, I mean... Oh, wait, where's my knight? Can I hit this? Okay, I sack my bishop cause, just to find out where my pieces are. Uh-oh. Okay. Well, that could have gone badly. Check. 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 You lose. Oh, that was close. That was close. I almost made it a few more moves to um, win on time. Just need to play, just need to remember where my pieces were, just a little bit better. Like, F3, so we're playing in England. Uh, my opponent's playing some kind of crazy counter England. Uh, we're gonna try to take the knight. Take this, Check. take that. Um, Check. I can't castle out of check. 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 Can't see a damn thing, but we'll just keep moving the king around. Check. Check. Wait, where's my king? Where's my... Oh, gosh darn it. You lose. Okay. The king ended up on g7. Yeah, that's really my only plot or chance here, is to try to confuse the opponent so he runs out of time. Uh, this one might not go so well, guys. I hate to break it to you. I've already moved my e pawn. I have a knight on c3. Take that. Can't take that. Can't move this. Um, I don't know. I don't know where any of my pieces are. You lose. Um. Yeah, making legal moves is important. Um. But now, against the twenty-two hundred, I mean, I have to play something aggressive. He's not just going to roll over on the clock. Some players might, but not a 2200. Okay, we're going to hit this knight. 
Do it again. Take it. Wow. Check. Okay, my knight's supported. Okay. Check. Wait. Well, let's check. Do I not have bishop takes queen? Okay, I did have bishop takes queen. Check. doesn't work. Victory. Nice! Beat a 1400 guys! How amazing is that? That was actually a really good game. Oh. Ready. Wow. Yeah, I got an advantage out of the opening and pressed it through the entire game. Uh, granted, the advantage was an entire piece sack. So it's not like I was playing some super skillful, nuanced thing. Um, but yeah, that was cool. Wait, can I not castle? Okay, is this not defended? I guess not. Where's my rook? Okay, I will get your pawn. I got your pawn here, man. Okay. I lost my queen to do it. Um, but I got the pawn. You lose. Just needed to play legal moves faster there. <sighs> okay. We got Ready. this, guys. We can do this. Um, okay, he dares to play my opening against me. Perhaps not the Check. brightest maneuver. Wait, I can't castle. Okay, I don't know what's going on there. Um, Check. For some reason I can't castle and I can't move my knight. Something has gone really awry here. Oops. Wait, where's my king? Check. Check. Okay. You lose. I played f6 instead of knight f6. That was unintentional. That explains my confusion. That's why I couldn't figure out how to continue. Because I couldn't play knight f6, and yet there was a knight in the way, preventing me from castling. Um, yeah, I'm mouse slipping all over the place here. got my queen. We're going to concede that. Yeah, I just looked over at the moon move list after I played Ready. queen c7, and I saw his last move was knight takes e6, and um, it's the one saving grace here is I do have the move list, so this isn't entirely impossible. It's just mostly impossible. Uh, wait. Bishop takes bishop. Okay, this is going to suck. Do I take the knight? Um, don't really have a choice. Oh, he got my queen in a fork. And I'm down 10 seconds. So we resign that one. Um, 
Well, the good news here is that it's like playing an opening, but you have no time in which to forget where you just moved. Um, so in a way, this is like far less painful than normal uh, blindfold chess, which I have also tried that. But um, can we take the knight? Yeah, so basically just it's not that hard to remember where you moved the pieces because you just moved it there. Like, that's a misconception. Um, yeah. Obviously in blindfold chess you have to care about where you moved stuff. Um, but I just have no time to forget where I moved it. Okay, rook takes queen? That's not legal. Can I move my knight then? Check. Jeez. Oh, I got mated. That's what I get for moving pieces near my king. Although I think he had a queen and a rook Ready. on the second row, so I probably was not surviving that. Uh, go first. Okay, we're just gonna transpose into a gambit. Or not. Oh, I took there. That was unintentional. Okay, we'll take one of these. One of, oh, can't win the rook. Uh, let's go back. Castle. Hit the knight, even though it's defended. Um, protect this. Just try to get some pieces off the board. Uh-oh. At least he's playing kind of slowly. Um, Check. Okay. Check. Check. Oh, I just go back. Okay. You know, with the knight on f4, I guess queen g2 is mate. I don't think there is a way to force. Well, Ready. it would take considerable coding to force everybody to play blindfold. You just have to do it by consensus, I guess. And even then, there could be potential for cheating. So, yeah, there's no incentive for the site to have any official enforced bullet tournament or enforced blindfold. Um, uh, take the knight. Where does bishop go? Queen takes f3. Wait, I have no idea where my pieces are again. Like, I've lost track of my queen. That's not check. That's not check. Okay. Do I have a queen on d8? Yes, I do. At least I did. King's trapped by queen on f7. I thought that was a... Ready. I'm not sure what I thought that was. Uh, I had no idea what it was. Right? Check. Wait, can I take that? I must. Okay. Check. 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 That's not good. Check. Check. Can I not run away? Check. You lose. Okay, that rook on f8 must be... Oh, we played rook af1. 
So he had two rooks on the f-file, so I wasn't threatening king takes rook on f8. Okay. That's a bit tricky. Ready. Go and berserk. <laughs> okay. Uh, the chances are real here, guys. Uh, chances are real. Uh, okay, we hit the knight. Out of the damn fork. Just a queen takes queen opportunity earlier. Check. Check. Damn it. How do I not have any moves? Where's my king? Check. I can't see my king. No, my king was Easy. on h2, but has very few legal moves. Oh, I needed to go back to h2 here. He must have a bishop over this way. Um. Ready. Okay. something in the way. Okay. Oops, there goes my queen. That was a good game. Um, oh, was, my opponent was 2100, basically. Okay. Um, I'm gonna have a lot of really confused opponents after this tournament. Um, that's for sure. Alright, knight of six. Oh, hey, look, free bishop. Wait. Oh, I played d3, damn it. Oh, no. Check. d3 was a terrible mouse slip. Well, I'm not happy with that. I just need to make some good legal moves here. Check. You lose. Oh, was, oh, he had 15 seconds. Ready. Never mind. Never mind. Okay. That's uh, my move again. Can my rook go? Oh, I lost my queen. Okay. I'll concede that. Ready. Okay. Um. Do I have nothing defending that? Okay, so... Well, I guess my opponents will just imagine that, um, that I was just intimidated by the time pressure or something. Ready. Okay. Oh, well that's no good. Uh, let's take here. OK. 
Okay, we saw it. Can't take the queen. Hang on. Check. You lose. Okay, so I did take his queen. That's an achievement. Ready. Uh oh. Um. Ah, uh, crap. All right, so we're gonna see if I can turtle up. Um. Oh, he takes my queen. Yeah, we're gonna concede that. Um, Ready. So much for turtling. Yeah, against a 2100, I can't try to. I can't even pretend to attack. Uh, I took my opponent's hanging Ready. queen. He, he assumed he could do pawn takes queen, but the pawn was pinned. Um, so there I managed to intimidate my opponent into actually thinking I could see the pieces. Assuredly he would have beaten me in any time scramble, but... Um, the key is to try to confuse them. Oh. Okay. Wait. Check. Okay, I have nothing protecting Check. my king. Check. Rook 8h2. You lose. Yeah, rook 8h2 kind of makes me think I'm not winning that. Oh, this is just a preference on leechess.org that allows you to... Um, play without seeing the pieces. Um, well, I can't take there. Check. I have no idea where anything's at anymore. Check. Okay, I have no legal moves there. Oh, he took it. Wow. You lose. Impressive. I thought, like, surely if he'd moved that quickly that I would be able to snatch a queen or something. Oh, the theme. That's a user style. Um, that's a com combination of my preferred user style and my preferred uh, user script that just color everything. Uh, okay, we're going to take this. Okay, try not to hang anything. Knight on f8, there's no mate. There's the knight. Everything's alright. Oh crap, he takes and doubles my pawns. Which he didn't do. Um, stopping the mate. Even blindfolded, I can see that one. You have to give me a little bit of credit. Um, okay, I don't remember where any of my pieces are, but I saw the mate in one there, okay? Yeah, I'm not winning this. Okay. Yeah, it's very bright and colorful and cheerful. Um, which might be a bit deceptive for this site. Okay, let's trade queens. Check. Wait, oh, I checked him, not he, not him checking me. I tried to play bishop e3, Check. this castle. Uh, 
I have like no Jack. hope of winning a time scramble here, apparently. Uh, let's take there. No, Jack. let's take there. Let's go back. Uh, let's go over. He takes my rook. I'm in time Jack. trouble. He's clearly outplaying me. <sighs> That's a shame. I am making an honest effort to try to win the event, so in the event that somehow I accidentally take 300th, it's totally not on purpose. Um, I'm playing black, right? Yeah. Hang on, I can take that. Check. Okay, he just did king takes rook. If he'd done some other piece taking the rook, maybe I could have pursued his king and maybe made it him. Um, so we're in 300 second place. Ten minutes to go. Ready. Uh, can I not castle? Can I castle like this now? I take that. No, I can take this way, but I'm losing a knight doing it. It would be far preferable if I could remember where my pieces are so I don't have to sack things to discover where they are at. Uh, oh, crap. Whatever was on c5, he took. Sack my queen to discover where I put all my stuff. Okay, can I take that? You lose. Okay, he took my queen. Alright. <clears throat> I tried. With a few seconds on my clock and me misclicking all over the place, I did the best I could to try to checkmate him there. Ready. Okay. Great. Yeah, this is gonna go well. Uh, let's play a gambit. Uh, let's go back. Take Check. that. Hit the Check. knight. Get the king out of here. Wait, did I not move the... Okay. Um... Yeah, I'm not winning against this 2100. He's pretty good. I can't do queen takes. A 
have pieces in the way, but I don't know where. Yeah, I'm not winning that. Okay. Yeah, no. People actually... Yeah, I should actually go back to trying the hippo. Oh, uh, wait. That's my move. The problem is my opponents tend to play ultra super yeah, fast yeah, when... Yeah, that, and I get mated if I play it wrong. Um, my opponents tend to be emboldened and play faster when I just play the hippo. Uh, they actually have any chance of playing legal moves. Um, I've got to... I've got to play more aggressively. Oh, crap. There goes my queen. And my bishop. Yeah, I'm not winning that. So I think it's fair to say that 300th place is kind of out of reach. Ready. Um, <laughs> oh, I go first. I don't know where my pieces are. It's a draw. I'll take it. I'll definitely take a draw in that circumstance. Ready. Oh, okay. Uh, C3. Okay, we're gonna hippo up this time. Well, that's no good. I did not hippo up very well. I'm guessing that pre-moving the hippo is not the safest strategy ever. Check. Wait, can my king not take that? Victory. See, that's how you win. And you're right, I did have to play the hippo to do it. It's slightly better because I can see hanging pieces. Monkeys can't see that sort of thing. Going berserk. Uh, wait, oh, I can't take that. I can't... Okay, I've got to take back... It's not legal. Crap, there goes my queen. He didn't take it. Can I take this? Check. 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 Victory. Ready. Yes! Best win of the tournament! Alright! Woo! Sorry about that. Sorry about the noise. I'm on a roll. Okay, I won another game. Um, that puts me in 267th place. I don't even care about the prize at 300 at this point. Oh, I go first. Uh, so my whole point of this game is to try to ruin this guy's hopes and dreams.
I don't have very much motivation to try them. E to C1, you say. Huh. Check. Wait, why is king f1 illegal? You lose. Is my king on g2? I don't remember where my king was at. Ready. Oh, okay. Well, that was a good try. Um, I have white. You guys like how I did that pre-move of queen takes bishop, Check. right? Just showing that I acknowledged I hung a piece, um, but I went forward anyway. Jeez. Oh, that's me! Okay. Well, at this point, we'll withdraw and watch the last game of the event, because we don't get a pairing in the last minute anyway. <laughs> Need to create 264 temporary accounts to join the tournament in the last minute, just so you can get that thousandth place prize. That would be impressive. Um, how is it possible that it's a 1500 playing blindfold bullet? Is this a new account? No, no, this is my account. Um, people have, I don't know, they keep saying that ratings don't adjust. Um... Well, let's hear the chime. Let's enjoy the... There we go. So, I did okay this tournament. I took whatever place I took. Uh, 269th. Um, so, let's take a look at some of these games. Uh, in particular, this one against Mr. Patate. Well, not, not this one. This is not the game. This is Fast Estonian. He was just really down on his luck this game. Um... So, he played this really strange opening. Um, I took his pawn and just really solidified this queen side and just figure I'm just gonna dash back and forth and back and forth. Um, so I hit the knight. Oh, the knight's not defended. Okay, so I protect the rook um, and just dash my king out of there. Check. And now I'm just trying to focus on what moves are legal for my king. And it so happens I kind of created this really nice fortress accidentally. And my queen on a is not an easy target either. Oh, why didn't I take the queen? Check. Anyhow, Check. Um, I think my moves sufficiently confused my opponent. Um, that, combined with the uh, time pressure, was something else. Yeah, I tried, I tried. Not not for try. I mean, I could have made a stronger effort toward the last few minutes to try to rig where I was in the standings, but no, I just played the best I could throughout the event. Um, and so here's another game I won. Let's see. Yeah, so you see, he just... This is another game where my opponent didn't play very aggressively. Um, I mean, sure, he did take my pieces as I hung them, but it took him some time to capture each hanging piece. And if he just played, like, some kind of solid strategy, I'm sure he would have done okay. Okay, this is what confused me. It's like, I saw him lining up here, and I was trying to move all kinds of pieces, like F5. And I was really trying to escape my rook, get my king out this way, and try to block the queen in various ways. And none of the legal moves I could come up with were any good. So I happened upon this move, queen takes g6. This confused my opponent because it just hangs a piece outright. Um, but it hangs a knight, not a queen. So this was a perfectly timed accident. Could not have asked for better. Um, 
And yeah, I just hung the queen, not even seeing that h5 was played. And I'm guessing he was in the middle of playing something else and changed his mind to thinking, oh, I'll just take the queen, and ran out of time. So that's pretty much the story of my wins in this event. Um, and this win against a 1400. Uh, I took the pawn here. See, yeah, it's kind of forced to take here, otherwise I take b2 and then take the rook with the pawn. And I just run away. Um, oh, this, this is the best part of the tournament, by far. I was really happy with this one. Because he thought that he could just do pawn takes queen back. And blindfolded, I saw, no, 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 that's not how the moves work. That's not a legal move in this position. And um, seeing my rating of 1623, and the fact that I just took a couple of his pieces, and I'm up a queen and a knight, um, my opponent failed to consider the fact that I'm blindfolded. And there's no way he could have known, but had he known, he probably would have played on and beaten me. So that was probably my best win of the event. Um, if you guys have any questions about the remainder of my games, feel free to ask. Um, but yeah, I think overall, pretty solid event. 10 out of 10. Probably would not play again. It's, it's too ridiculous. You just don't do it that way. So before I forget, uh, let me go back to my preferences and say, Invisible Pieces? No. Invisible Pieces is a bad, bad idea. Um... Yeah, that was quite an event. So now we're at 1554. The good news is our rating can only go up from here, right? Um, so, whew, that was quite the workout. Um, yeah. I mean, I guess you guys want to probably see some of my losses, too, just to see, like, how... Like, okay, this last game, obviously I got mated here, had no idea what was going on. That was the case for most of these games. Um, just getting mated without some kind of accident happening. Um, what were some of my longest games in this tournament? It'd be cool if I could filter games by move count. Okay, so here's my game against 1172. I ran out of time. We are on move 35. He's going to get a queen and mate me anyhow, but uh, actually he was doing really well on the clock, so... I was going to say maybe I could have won that on time, but no, that's not realistic. Um, and... Okay, here's one I just outright resigned against the 1700. I moved 22. Um, uh, I saw I was in huge, immense time pressure, and I couldn't make any legal moves. I forgot where I'd moved my pawns, and I already lost my rook. I thought I'd lost my queen, that's not the case, but I also thought I lost this rook, also not the case. But I did see h6 was coming, and I didn't know whether I had a pawn here or not, but my bishop couldn't move anywhere. I mean, it, theoretically if this rook weren't here, then I guess bishop f8 would be legal, but I saw the bishop, queen, and pawn were all in the vicinity of my king, and I saw this f-pawn earlier move here and disregarding the entire rest of the position where really nothing's happening. Um, yeah, that that's why I concede it there. So, I think I might now start playing some rated bullet chess. Um, so let's see. Is there a open bullet tournament? There's so many tournaments going on it's hard to tell. Like, there's the daily hyper bullet. Um, I guess we're going to play the Daily Hyper Bullet and see how this goes with contrast to the games I just played. Ready. Right. See if I can regain some of my lost rating points. Or if I'm forever doomed to 1500 dumb. No, uh, Hyper Bullet's really not my thing. I much prefer uh, One Minute. It's just a lot easier to play good moves in one minute than it is in Hyper Bullet. 
Hey, hang on. There's a yeah. good move. I'm entitled to one good move a game. Note I couldn't actually take the queen in that position. Victory. But I went on time. <laughs> Ready. Oh, that's a sad story. Now look, all the people are sad, and it's all your fault. Check. 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 Oops, that's no good. I'm going to win on time there. That's more than good enough. Oh, it did grow back. Okay. Well, then I guess um, Ready. that's a lot better. Take my pawn? Alright, take it that way. That's fine. Check. 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 Victory. There we go. See, it's a lot easier to win those end games though in just normal bullet than it is in hyper bullet. Ready. Um. I wonder if they'll ever make a separate rating category for blindfolded. It might be appropriate. Oh, he saw it. GG. Check. Ready. Yeah, it's a lot easier to watch um, when you can actually see me moving the pieces, that's for sure. That was funny though, before the event, um, uh, some of the admins were saying, you know, maybe we'll just um, save you the time and effort and we could just fill out the score sheet with all zeros for you. Um, just because, you know, blindfold is kind of difficult. Check. Uh, I told them that wouldn't be necessary, Check. that my goal was to just win a game. Realistically. 
Check. Not take that. Check. You lose. Bummer. Could not move the rook fast enough to play rookie one mate, so I had to drop it and root. Which is pretty bad Check. for my position. Check. Check. Also, you see my mouse waggling all over the place because I'm playing kind of clumsily with this mouse. I used to have a better mouse, and then a family member broke it. Uh, so I'm playing with my backup mouse. Uh, it's not my preferred one, and... I'm just putting all the excuses out there in case you're curious. Uh, okay. Check. Oh, that's no good. You lose. Yeah, he's got my rook. Well played. Oh, well, I guess that's a fair point. Why would they bother making a blindfold category if nobody's going to use it? Uh, I don't know. I guess perhaps so when I do use it, I don't upset the entire rating system. Um, or maybe they'll just encourage me to use a separate account or something for this if they can't uh, create a category for it. I'm definitely causing some rating points to get redistributed today. Check. Free queen. Check. Take one of those. Check. 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 Victory. On. Check. There'd be a trap. Nice. I don't know how I managed to win that on time. Going berserk. Uh, going berserk doesn't seem very wise, buddy. I wouldn't do that if I were you. Uh, crap. Move the rooks to legal squares. Check. Uh, Check. Victory. Nice. Okay. I need to play better, though. Ready. Yeah, well, I'm not... 
No, you don't gain rating deviation. That's the problem, is that there's no volatility. Um, there's... You gain points, you lose points, but your rating deviation always decreases with each game, because each game you always know more about your performance than you do the previous time. So there's no way to gain rating deviation other than just sitting it out. Click that. Check. Oh, there goes my queen. You lose. Not winning down a queen. Um. Oh, there's a setting. You just go over to preferences, and it's the bottom setting, blindfold. Um, you just click that, and you'll never see the pieces again. Um. Check. Victory. It's complete and ridiculous garbage that you can win that, but that's bullet. Um, Couldn't catch up on the clock. Ready. Uh, okay. Victory. Nice. Ready. Go and berserk.
I should have taken the uh, C1. Going berserk is not a winning strategy. <laughs> yeah, it's great how you can just hang pieces in Hyperbullet and Ready. it's actually a good move. Um, well, I'm out of ideas. Yeah, I'm not winning that. All right. You got me, pal. Ready. Can I move the pieces, please? Occasionally, good moves matter. Going berserk. Oh, we're going berserk, eh? Ready. That was kind of a mouse slip. Check. Victory. Nice. I'll take it. So, Ready. see, in the span of like 10 games, and you remember the last tournament, I played tons and tons and tons of games. Um, uh, we see that I'm regaining most of the rating points I lost. Right? And it's not like I'm playing like some super GM or something, gaining these back. Uh, Check. Oh, that doesn't work. So you see, I went from 1,500 to 1,800 Ready. in like 10 games. It's not that hard uh, to regain the points. Here, let's just sack the knight. Uh, G4. bad. Alright. <clears throat> no, that wasn't my point. Although, my playing in this um, just shows 
Ready. Like my initial point playing the playing blindfold ball was just to do something original and fun. Um, and really here, um, Check. just playing the game back some of my rating points. Uh, oops, there goes my queen. Check. 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 Okay, he takes Easy. it. Yeah, we're going to concede that. Ready. Maybe I'm not as good at hyper bullet as I am at just plain old bullet. It's hard to play tricky moves in hyper bullet. Um, because most of them just don't work. And even when they do work, it's more about Check. playing things quickly on the uh, to win on time. Check. I say as I get mated, <laughs> thus proving um, the counterexample. Check. 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 Even there, I got him down to four tenths of a second by playing utter and complete nonsense. So I almost won that game. Go and berserk. Just as long as you are playing moves, it really doesn't matter what moves you're playing. Check. 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 Now there are exceptions to that rule. Um, gotta check, check. in. Now, I'm playing a lot slower than my opponents, too, so when I win on time, that's indicative that they're not playing well at all. Um, if he had played just a little bit faster or a little bit better, he could have won that. I actually drew that, because I took all his stuff. Uh, okay, so my opponent saw that idea. Take that. Take this. Check. Can I take this? No, I cannot take that because I get pinned. Whatever. Oh, he berserked me. Okay, so I shouldn't um, be so quick to criticize then. Uh, can I move the pawn? My mousing problems are pretty bad with this mouse. Let's take that. And hang my queen. 
you know, just for dramatic effect. Go figure I can't beat a 2100 on time um, when uh, my pieces don't drop on the squares I want them to drop on. Ready. <laughs> uh, okay. Hmm. Seven. I need to play King E7 and then Rook G2, which are on opposite ends of the board. Check. Can I take his pawns? Made a valiant effort to hold that, um, but I got him somehow anyway. But yeah, when I slip up big like that, it's because I'm trying to make a move on one end of the board and then prepare for a move on the other end. And I make a mouse Ready. slip on the first half of that. Berserk against me is not the best idea you can come up with. I, I guess the good news about the Berserk button is it does encourage rating points to get just redistributed in the pool. Um... Fast Estonian. Ready. I was going to play that anyway, but the fact that he played the way he played just made that more humorous. Fortunately, my opponent fell for mate and one instead of taking the exchange. Um. Going 
for cheapos. Oh, yeah. My opponent's going for the same cheapo. I should be concerned about such things. Oh, that's mate in one. Well, you got me. You got me good. Ready. But yeah, for those who doubt the rating system, it adjusts quickly, man. So, we saw last tournament I lost like 500 points. This tournament I've gained... Uh, about 400. Um, so there's really nothing to worry about when people say that I'm overrated or I'm underrated. It's, I mean, it's really uh, quibbling over some nuance which doesn't exist. Free Rook Airlines. Sack that anyway. Take Check. here. In the night. Victory. Ready. Well, I guess it's true. Um, but in slower games, you have a high, you have a greater rating deviation because you don't play as many games. So um, you would see a greater adjustment per game instead of having to play tons of games for your rating to get adjusted. So it all actually works out because each pool, well, each rating has its own separate deviation number, uh, which says how flexible that rating estimate is. He had me though. He was doing better that game, um, and then converted his position and material into time on the clock. Ready. Ready. Can I just do this? Oh crap. You also have to recognize when it's time to bail out of various combinations and ideas. I don't have any legal moves there. There we go. By virtue of having no legal moves, I decided to keep playing on in the hopes of a stalemate, and it did materialize. Uh, okay, we'll move it one square if I can't move it two. Apparently I'm just too clumsy to move pieces uh, the correct number of squares. Check. 
check. Too clumsy to move in this hyper bullet stuff. So I guess in hyper bullet I am probably about 1900. Um, whereas a normal bullet I might be 2000 or maybe above that. But hyper bullet I guess I've uh, topped out at 1900. Not winning that, that's for sure. <laughs> Ready. Yep, there was a plane that just went by. Not much I can do about that. Well, until such time that maybe I get a sound studio or something, which is totally not going to happen for this. But yeah, if I had a sound studio, then we wouldn't have to worry about planes. There was not enough time to get my mouse to a, one of my pieces on the board, so I elected to just stop moving the cursor and just watch for... There wasn't even time for me to click the resign button, uh, so I just stopped moving there. Who did I just beat? I wasn't even watching. Hardwood Pusher, 1926. Ready. Well, no, I should buy a new mouse to train for Hyper Bullet. Um,
Check. 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 There we go. That wasn't so hard. Ready. Thankfully, my bishop covered f3, so that simplified some of that. Damn it, can I not move to the corner? Jeez. I kind of deserve that one. I needed to take on h3. Ready. Why is it echoey? Why is what echoey? Is something echoey? Am I echoey? Uh, it's probably the mic picking up the computer sounds. Again. Despite how many times I turned down my speakers and such to try to get that to not happen, um, sometimes it does get through. I'll try turning them down again after the game. Check. Oops, there goes my queen. Turn this down a touch. Oh, the check sound. I mean, yeah, that must be my computer. Uh, my speakers, so. I'll turn down the sound a little bit so I can't hear it. Um, I say that with a touch of, um, I don't know, sarcasm, Ready. I guess is the word. Um, If I had heard it say check or such a little bit faster, um, or a little bit louder, maybe I would move faster. I don't know. Really what I need to do, I guess, is um, balance the audio that happens through this interface. I guess what that means is just that in general I can't use uh, the robot check noise anymore. I have to use a sound set that doesn't have the check noise because it's not balanced with the rest of the noises. Can I take the queen? Check. There we go. There goes my rook. Didn't need it anyway. 
Chair. Chair. Yeah, this is lost. I'm not winning that one. Um, damn, my opponent was outplaying me and Ready. capturing my pieces. Or well, he's playing faster and taking all my stuff, so. How you know when it's time to throw in the towel. Check. GG, man. GG. Okay, you don't play F6 Ready. in Hyperbullet. Just in case you didn't know. It's just not a bad, but not a good idea. Check. There's like a one and something chance that you might just throw the entire game by playing F6. And what have you gained? I don't know. It's not a good position. Need to take that. Step over here. So that's not going to work. Crap! I Check. really thought he wouldn't do queen takes. Check. Check. It's a draw. Called it! I saw that coming. My opponent didn't see it. This is why you always check in those end games. You don't try to win it. You don't try to checkmate unless you really, really know it's checkmate. Ready. Okay. But yeah, if you're not absolutely certain it's checkmate, just don't go for it. Unless you're absolutely compelled to just by the time on the clock. Um, but usually you have enough time to check your opponent and... Um, Oops. I misclicked on the window. And there goes my queen. So, I resized the window accidentally trying to reach the piece on the board. Just to give you an idea of how accurate my mouse clicks are. <laughs> or how precise they are. I'm not sure which word's better for that situation. Is it, would it be accurate or precise? No, no, no. There, I had no pieces to attack with. Like, if I see that my opponent's king is completely safe, Ready. and I'm under a mating attack and down a queen, I might consider resigning that. Um, there are points where resigning is actually kind of appropriate in Hyperbullet. Oops, there goes my queen. Check. Yeah. Check. 
Check. Check. Check. Yeah, so I'm down there an infinite amount of material and have nothing to mate with. Um, I exaggerate slightly, but whoa, that was cool. That double rook in front of the king does not happen often. I just move my pieces once in a while and not mouse slip. Wouldn't that be a beautiful thing? Okay, let's take a moment to appreciate this game. Because I don't think we're going to get a pairing the last minute of the tournament. Even if we did, we wouldn't have time to finish it during the event. So, Check. Fast Estonian? Check. Definitely on the run Check. here. Check. Uh, there's a sack. You're just trying Check. to play moves that you know are going to be legal, and that works. Uh, do we have one more game? Oh, well this one's not not going to finish before the tournament ends, but it's our number one player. So let's take a look. Check. That going berserk against fast Estonian is something else. I guess you figure if you're going to win, you're going to do it quickly or it's just not going to happen. It's not going to count for the tournament results. Um, so yeah, he went berserk and you saw from his moves that they were pretty berserk. Um, Actually, you saw black went for all up for an attack, while white was the one who went berserk this game. Um, Check. That's curious. All right, we see a promotion. We don't check. see a promotion. Oh, there's a check. check. He sees the checks. Check. 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 That's too bad. All right, let's take a look at the result. Congratulations for the top ten. Oh, nice! I did not know it made that noise. Uh, what does that sound like in the standard sound set? I suppose I don't get more than one chime. That was good fun, though. Um, so yeah, you see, ratings do adjust quickly, and even though Hyperbullet's not necessarily my thing, I did manage to get back up to 1966. I'd probably do better in just plain Bullet, or something even slower, but that was good fun. Uh, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, uh, hope maybe we learned something, I'm not sure. Uh, blindfold is difficult, uh, don't try it at home. All right, so thanks for watching. Uh, have a good weekend, and I'll see you guys around.